Hello, how's it going? Today, we're just gonna do a little short video on how to make magnesium bicarbonate water. That's right, magnesium bicarbonate. Like, why would I wanna make mag magnesium bicarbonate? Well, because you probably need some magnesium. Magnesium is a very important thing for your body, it really is. Um, it is, is one of the most crucial things to put in your body. And a lot of us are a little, you know, on the deficient side of things. I felt like I was. And in seeking out the ways to uh, supplement with magnesium, this is, this is what, I, you know, I've been told is the most bioavailable form. And it's actually pretty cheap and easy to make. And uh, yeah, it's easy on your body to get. So magnesium is important, y'all. And this is just a very bio a bioavailable way to get that. And so I'm gonna show you how to do it. I'm gonna show you real quick, right? And so basically what you're doing is you're getting some magnesium hydroxide. And then you're just looking for carbonated water, all right? Really, you just want water and CO2, all right? Because the whole thing is this binds with the CO2 in here and makes that magnesium bicarbonate, right? Just get a little cup to hold it in, get a scale so you can measure properly. After you dial it in, you probably can measure out the right amount scoop and correlate that with whatever it weighs. And then you want a funnel. You want the biggest possible opening you can get to fit in there because you want the little amount, littlest amount of CO2 to release out of here. Um, before you can close that lid so you can get the maximum absorption of the CO2 combining with the magnesium hydroxide, right? And so with this bigger whole um, funnel, I'm able to just boom, put it in, close it up, right? And so basically how you do this, I'm gonna show you right now. So you just take this stuff, open it up, tear out your scale so you get the right weight. This is a liter bottle, right? And so you just want four grams. I tend to go a little over four grams because if it if you are over, it just won't all bind. So I go for five grams. So that just happened to be five grams. And with five grams, usually you get a little bit of like settling in the bottom. But I find that I want the total absorption. I'd rather a little bit left over than, um, than not have the, the full on potency of the magnesium bicarbonate water, right? And then here's the thing, y'all, you wanna be fast, right? You wanna open this up, boom, get the stuff in and close it back up. So you ready? You ready? Cool, so it's opening, getting the bubbles, putting it in, bang, it's down, going back off, whoop, spilled a little, that's another reason why it's nice to overweight and we're closed up. And y'all, this is the fun part, you know? This is a carbonated thing and you're gonna shake it. That's right, you're gonna shake it up. You can hand this to a friend or you can do this to impress people and be like, yeah, I'm shaking a carbonated thing. I'm not worried about it. Cause I know what's gonna happen. What's gonna happen is that powder that you just put in there is binding with the CO2 that's in here. You wanna shake it for at least 30 seconds, right? Um, and so I'm gonna talk while you're shaking. The main thing with this too is this water, you want it to be cold, right? So definitely make sure you put it in the fridge for at least an hour. Shake this puppy up. Shaking things are always fun. Um, so yeah, at least 30 seconds, probably been at least 30 seconds, but I've been talking to you and not counting, right? And then after you have sh shaken it all up, then you put this back in the fridge for a whole half an hour, right? So I'm gonna go do that. So I just put that one in the fridge, and then I'm gonna make another one, put this one in the fridge, shake it up, put it in the fridge, and then after in half an hour, you're gonna pull it out, and you'll see some magic has occurred. So it's been over half an hour, we've taken them out. They're still nice and tight to the touch, but check this out. We're gonna shake it up, boom, and instantly it starts deflating, right? So it's deflating, because all that, you know, the, the pressure from the CO2 and the carbonation has been all sucked up by the, uh, you know, it's been bonded with the, the magnesium hydroxide. So the end result, it's not a carbonated beverage anymore. So watch this, I'll open this up. Isn't that fun? That's fun. So then it opens up, gives you more, more shaking power. Shake it for another 30 seconds. Boom, but yeah, it's just that easy, folks. So it's all shaking up, you can do it again. I mean, really, the more shaking, the better, right? Um, so I'll do it to this one. This one's tight. Now watch. As soon as I shake it, boom, it gets kind of all deflated. It's kind of a cool little effect. It's science, folks. 
Science is all the rage today, right? So this is some science before your eyes, like, like it ain't no thing. Bang, there you go. So it pops open. It's always an enjoyable experience. And then shake it again. Get that shake going for 30 seconds. Boom, you got it, you know? This is some magnesium bicarbonate water, right? The dose that you're gonna wanna drink, what I usually drink is eight fluid ounces, right? So that looks like this. Again, I like to do it in the morning. I'm gonna do it now because I actually didn't have any this morning, so whatever. Right, there we go. Eight fluid ounces. Yeah, bottoms up, magnesium bicarbonate. But yeah, it's not carbonated anymore. I think you got that, right? <laughs> Bottoms up, happy magnesium bicarbonating. Hope you guys make this, definitely help. You need it, do it. Um, or you need a bunch of chocolate. <laughs> not all chocolate is created equal though, gang. We'll talk about that in another video. But stay tuned, all right? <laughs> Subscribe if you haven't already. Check us out. We're doing all sorts of video about all sorts of wild stuff, right? From fungus to health to nutrition to wild off-grid lifestyles growing our own food. We're just trying to get all 5D on it. So, you know, subscribe, check us out, hit the little bell button and then you'll get notifications and you can stay up. My goal is to do this on a regular basis, folks. So thanks for tuning in. Much love. Mwah. Mm. Oh, it's pretty good.